Welcome to Cobot. This video will show you how to set up your invoice settings. To get started, go to Setup, Invoice Settings. Let's start at the top. The Invoice Sender section should be your legal company information that you want to appear on your invoices. The invoice format is what will determine the numbering sequence on your invoices. Invoice numbers will be counted up from the number in curly braces. For example, if you add your space, YYY, 100, the numbering on your invoices will start from your space, 2019, 100. Any text added to the invoice text box will appear at the bottom of the invoice. The two tax fields are very different. The first one is the name of the tax as you would like it to appear on your invoice. So if you, as a company, have to charge your members VAT, then enter that here. You can set the tax rate under Setup, Basic Settings. The second field is the name of the tax ID your members can add to their accounts. They will see this on the sign-up form. Again, this will be a tax ID unique to your member. It will also be shown on the invoice, as well as within their member profile here. The default invoice dropdown is the day you would like the system to automatically set your member's first billing date. For example, if you choose number one, this will be the date the system auto-selects when you or your members sign up for a membership. It will also mean automatic proration of the membership for the remaining days in the month, depending on the sign-up date. For example, if somebody signs up on October the 8th, but you want your billing sequence to be the first of the month, the system will automatically prorate them from October 8 to October 31st, and then will automatically set their next recurring billing date to November 1, and so on. The Generate and Send Invoices Early field will send your invoices by email a certain amount of days early. If you put in seven, for example, your members will receive an email with their invoice. They will be able to review the charges, and will be made aware that an auto billing will take place in seven days. This will just email your members and will not charge them until their automated billing date. If you would like a copy of your invoices to go to someone other than an admin of your space, such as an accountant, then you can add their email address here. By checking this box, your members will not be able to see existing invoices or a preview of their next invoice from within their member portals. By checking this box, your members will automatically receive an email with their invoice when it is generated. By checking this box, you enable accounting codes. If you'd like to make it so you're able to review all invoices before sending them, go to Customize, Features, Payments, and enable Invoices Must Be Charged Manually. Your member invoices will still be created on the invoicing date, but it will not automatically send or charge your members. You'll be able to review them under Manage Invoices, make any customizations, and then manually charge and send them to your members. Check out our next video to learn how to set up your resources so your members can make bookings. Yeah.